In our portfolio, we, we do both. We hedge always and often, uh, but then we do put on a tactical hedge. Why do we do that and what's our triggers to do that? Well, you understand options are affected by time, volatility, and movement. Uh, the, what we use as a trigger is we use uh, the volatility service. Now, that's just a, a big word for saying the, the demand for options going out in time and, and uh, above or below spot. And, and as that volatility surface changes, there's more edge. So in other words, when markets become volatile, if you understand options, you actually could hedge more efficiently. So it's not too late to hedge if the markets become volatile, even though, yes, a protective put does become more expensive. The truth of the matter is, as that surface, as the something called the skew becomes very steep, it actually becomes where I can invest a dollar to make 10. Options have curvature, they have convexity. Yes, bombs has convexity, but optionality, um, I could spend a dollar to make 10 on a hedge. So as, as Peter says, my total downside loss is a dollar. That's a very nice way to manage a portfolio. So just in conclusion, we'll, if you use, let's say, the VIX as a, as a proxy, let's assume that VIX starts to really move higher. What, what basically you're going to look at is that there is more efficient short-term hedges that you could trigger at that time to create that cost to potential profit in a very, uh, a very favorable light.